All right, and we're back with part two. Sorry about me getting cut off um, back there. My freaking gameplay just cut me off like that. Anyway, what I was saying was my combo is the dimmers to snipe and the shotgun is when frickers come too close to me. Now, as you can see there, uh, that is not what you're supposed to use the needler for. The needler is completely use useless against the cat things. The shotgun uh, takes two shots. <laughs> but yeah, I, I made a very bad mistake or good. Well, it's not a good mistake. But well, there is no such thing as a good mistake. Well, yeah, there is. So I, I come see see the needler is good against the big guys. I completely demolish the hammer guy, so it's gonna be a bit easier. But then I end up wasting the ammo. Although I do take out that brew and I, I use it wisely there. But then I use it to take out grunts and stuff, which is just stupid. But anyway, um, when brutes get too close to me, the shotgun, even if they're not too close to me, I still use it because they'll stumble, and that gives me enough time to then shoot them again and take them out. Whoa! Ugh, sorry about that. Had some, uh, had a healthy choice fudge flavored popsicle before I did this, and, uh, it's, uh, coming up. Coming back up. So, anyway, I ran out of ammo on the needler. I was looking around for weapons, found the plasma pistol. I'm using it to take out grunts. First time I've actually, you know, used it like this. I'm not overcharging it to take out shields. Uh, the skirmishers, they're completely impossible to get, um, because they dodge everything. They're freaking fast, they're freaking skinny. Those stupid cat things. Take them out and crap, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you are glad. Oh, shot him. Oh, boom! Nailed him. Okay, wait, he lived. Or, I don't know what happened. Wait, he lived. So, wait, he was the only one who lived? Dang. Well, how did he live, though? So, I kept my shotgun for the heck of it. Uh, I grabbed my dimmer. I, I don't get it. That guy in the elevator. What, was he fighting the whole time? I don't get it. Like, what the heck, man? I could have used help at, back there. Frick. Oh, what's that CJ thing? I don't know. Jeez, man, I, I needed your help. I was screwed back there. Frick you. Yeah, take that. Melee to the face. Jerk. Oh, uh, everything went black. Because <laughs> I melee him. Oh, uh, now it's back. Never mind. Never mind. I'm good. So I'll go in here and look at the very depressing scene of all the civilians that are hurt, even though they're complete idiots standing around the battlefield and crap. I kill them. You know, if you kill a civilian, you immediately die. So don't kill the civilians. Unless if you feel like it and, you know, you're evil and crap. I mean, I melee them, sure, but uh, I don't kill them. At least not on Legendary. So this is where we meet the ODST guys. They're really cocky. They think they're the best. They're like, you ready? Welcome to the Leapfrogs. Try to keep up, Spartan. They're freaking cocky as crap. Most of these jumps, you can make it without even using the jetpack. I mean, sure, this one, you need the jetpack. But, like, this one over here, I, I don't... I, I, I mean, most of these jumps, like, you don't even need the jetpack, so it's like, screw you, frickin' ODST guys, frickin' cocky. We're clear. <laughs> but yeah, here you can, um, uh, you can snipe all you want, because you now you have full ammo, as you can see, I picked up dimmer ammo back there. Uh, the ODST guys are stupid, because they, you know, go ahead with the battle and stuff, they go into the middle of it and die right away. Um, taking out the grunts and stuff, nice sniping, um, not as good as the jackal, though. Um, that grunt there with the, um, the, dang it, I still don't know what it's called. I don't, sorry. I don't remember. The green blast or whatever the frick it's called. Um, so the ODST guys are getting their butts handed to them. Um, this is not kill-tacular, and, uh, I got beat up there. They are dying. Crap, I gotta help them out a bit. So, um, I sniped a little bit. Now I'm gonna get closer because I've taken out a lot of them. Um, holy crap! Oh my god! Oh my frick, holy crap, that guy went flying, dang. Huh, he got pwned by a frickin' grunt. Man. That's that's a perfect place for there, there to say, oh snap! Or, oh snap! Holy crap, no! We gotta get out of here right now. <laughs> So pick up the frickin' green blaster thingy, and, uh, fight away at these guys. You know, I'm kind of wasting it, just because, uh, I don't know, I was frustrated, because I kept on dying at this part. So I used this gun just to, you know, take out them. I could have, you know, taken my time and crap, and, you know, screw it. I'm, I'm stupid. Um, going down here, pick up my shotgun, my shotgun. Uh, there's a sticky grenade there, so I'm going to go use a sticky grenade. In fact, I think I use it very wisely. I don't remember. Do I use it wisely? No, I don't. No, I don't. 
Oh, well, I get one kill out of it, so... Yeah, whatever. So, uh... Go back down here, pick up a sticky grenade. Holy crap, it just got really cold in my room. Oh, man. Oh, my spine is tingling. Feels like a freaking hand going up my spine with razor-sharp fingernails. So there's that hammer dude. He's trying to kill me. He's very easy, except for those sticky grenades. I stuck him once, and that took him out, which is, you know, lucky for me. So, that was easy. Um... These guys just take them out with the dimmer. Uh, again, headshots is all that counts. The jackals shoot them in the hand first and then the head. And yeah. That's uh That's the basics of legendary. Aim for the head. So waiting um to recharge. By the way, oh yeah, um crouching actually does heal you up faster. I figured that out on my own. It actually does. So uh you know, just using this box to my advantage, sniping hiding. Um, one, at one point I died just because, like, this random sticky grenade came out of nowhere, so I don't know what happened there. Uh, I wounded that guy with the fusion tank. It didn't kill him, though, so then I get a nice headshot on his cute little bald head. Hmm. He's funny. He's bald. Getting the sniper dude sniping him in the head. The funny looking jackal. Oh, man. These guys are falling and crap. Dang. Well, that guy fell off the building. Dang. There's only a jack, one jack, oh, well, there's, frick, frickin' up sentences. There's only one guy left, oh, wait, never, never mind, never mind, there's two left. There's two left. See, see, it takes three headshots. Took him out, though, and now there's a jackal, I don't know where he is. Again, I was taking my, t I was taking my time here, um, cause I had already died several times, cause I was kinda pissed. Take out the jackal, he was, not, I don't know what the heck he was doing, it looked like he was playing frickin', Lego Harry Potter, and he was reading on the wall of the, you know, you know the thing where you grab out the book and you gotta read from the library thing, and you're like, you gotta memorize it? I don't know, maybe he was watching TV or something. I don't know, he was distracted, though. This is the part in my fun, cool and funny clips where my dad was, you know, very useful, and, oh, nice stick! Where my dad was very useful, and didn't save my life whatsoever when I fell off the cliff. Dang. Uh, he just blasted that box, and I think that wounded him. Uh, that helps. Oh, frick. Oh. So... You gotta be careful. See, there's the shotgun. There's the shotgun. That's when the shotgun gets very useful. See? That guy's just walking along, not getting blasted at whatsoever. So lucky him. Wish I could do that. Dang. So he just walked along like that. His shadow's the only one who walks beside him. He's walking on the boulevard of broken dreams. Wait, oh, wait, he's, he is getting shot at. Oh, crap. Wait, I hope he's okay. Nope, he's dead. He is dead. Oh, but I avenged him, though. I avenged him. Yep. Alright, took those guys out. And, uh, oh, this is, this is a genius move by me. I was, uh, again, I, I didn't have a whole lot of health, so I was looking for a first aid kit. Looking around, you know, picking up sticky grenades and stuff. Looking around for one I didn't know where, and then I found one here, so I was like, oh, okay, thanks. So, uh, I'm flying my way back, wasting, like, ten minutes here. Um, by the way, you can, like, take a different route when going up this, you know, place, but, uh, when the, with the jetpack, but I took the normal route. I go over here, and then I find out this first aid kit right there, genius, so I melee that stupid first aid kit. And there's the dead ODST guy. Then there's this guy, didn't help us whatsoever, so I melee him the face. Into the face. Ah, stop yelling, ah, jeez. Other side, other side, entrance on the other side! Stop yelling. God, I can hear you, you know. All right. So got up here. This part's a bit tougher. This part is uh, everything's kind of escalating now. It's getting a bit tougher. Um, I use the rocket launchers, um, not on the grunts though. Don't waste it on the grunts. Use it on the bigger guys. So I get a nice double kill. Could have gotten a triple kill, but uh, obviously I did not. I make a really good grenade throw here though. So yeah, I'm gonna see you guys in part three. Wait, look at this. Look at this. The three jackals there and. Boom! Triple kill. Yeah. Oh, wait, what the frick? Oh, I'm, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Okay, apparently it's not over. Jeez, I'm stupid. Alright. Okay, um... God. Alright, so continue along here. I was trying to snipe that guy. That guy, that freaking that freaking brute leader guy was impossible to kill. I could not kill him. I was sniping him in the head, but for some reason, it would not kill him. I don't get what the heck was going on there, but... Stay back here and snipe and stuff. Only use the rocket launcher when you're close. There he is. I'm shooting at him. I'm shooting at him. I, I, I swear I'm shooting him in the head. It's not working. My reticle is red. My reticle is red as blood. God. And I finally... No, no. Yeah, got him. Frick you. 